Welcome back to The Sims 4 Cottage Living Rags to Riches. This is no longer brought to you by EA Game Changers or made possible by EA Game Changers because the game is officially out now. That also means you can download all the builds that I did in early access available on my gallery, which is James Turner YT. I'll also, if I remember, I'll link down below where you can find all my gallery builds so you can add them to your game as well. Now, the good news is I know a lot of you guys were missing the, uh, the, the name Watermark, so I just decided to go ahead and make my own that's going to be jumping around the screen the entire video. It also means that if anyone steals my content, we'll, oh, we'll know where it came from. <laughs> so, no, I'm kidding, I'm going to turn that off. But if you do want to see it, we can always bring it back. Okay, so the overwhelming comment last episode was to just go ahead and delete the floor in here and then we could use these plants in here or even just this. But look, I clearly didn't want to do that because if I wanted to, I would have just left move objects on and just put these in here anyway. Uh, I'm more than happy buying planters to put in. Also, geez, this lighting looks good, doesn't it? <laughs> doesn't that look really good? Um, yeah, I'm more than happy to just buy planters to put in here. Now, this technically doesn't fit here, which means we probably, yeah, they won't be able to access the two plants uh, on either side, which would be a problem. Uh, also, I don't have any money. So anyway, I'm not buying them, but that's what I want to do. Now, I am wondering if, well, I can't afford that sprinkler. Okay, okay. I have a couple of things I want to do this episode. I want to get another chicken coop. Although a lot of my chickens are dying, so maybe I don't need another. No, I do. Okay, let me let me clock my thoughts here. I'm going like way too fast. I want to get another chicken coop because I want to put the evil chicken in its own coop. Uh, in fact, we could even like build its own thing like really far away. Just, you know, to quarantine the chicken a little bit further away. We don't want the evil chicken... Uh, contaminating any of my other chickens. <laughs> that's that's the thing. Oh, actually, the other thing I want to do, I want this. Oh, it's 400 simoleons. Okay, so once we have 400, I'm going to buy another wild rabbit home because we're not seeing any rabbits appear on my lot. Uh, I don't know if they will just appear or if I do actually need the rabbit home, but we're going to get the rabbit home and hopefully that will attract rabbits if we're not getting them anyway. Also, my post box is really far away. Uh, I'm going to grab actually the this one from Get Together because I think that suits this house very nicely. Okie dokie. So what we're going to do, we need to re restore the upgrade to our chicken coop with the fox alarm because that's going to help us out a lot and, you know, make sure we're okay. But he can't do that at the moment because he's just so tired and hungry. So we're just going to go to sleep. We'll take care of that in the morning. There's some weeding and stuff to do, but that's okay. We'll do that soon. Uh, beautiful rain. So we love to see. So I guess what I would like to do this episode, if, because now it is summer, those spicy, was it? No, we had the spicy mushrooms. Nightly mushrooms. No, they grow in winter. Okay, never mind. We got the spicy mushrooms then. I was going to say, I wanted to get the mushrooms from our other barn, but those are the spicy ones that we already got uh, from that quest anyway, so that's fine. Uh, but I will want to try and get those, oh no, Hennessy. Hennessy, Hennessy, Hannah, Hanley, Ruli. Why is it everyone? Come on. <laughs> By the way, I know, th I, I remember, because uh, I mean, we did nine parts of this Let's Play series that I recorded within like three days, like three weeks ago. So I know it was a long time ago that I played it, but I remember reading a comment about someone saying they didn't want to get this pack because they were upset about the animals dying. The good news is in pack settings, you can actually turn off animal aging. So cows, chickens, foxes, llamas, and rabbits will no longer grow older. This does not affect cats and dogs. As you can see, it's only for cottage living. I don't think, I guess for cats and dogs, they're just part of the household because they actually show up in your, ha oh, in your household here. So that's probably in here. Anyway, the other thing is we also have auto aging off and auto aging unplayed sims is on. So all my played sims uh, do not age. So I know people are worried about Hazel or Chaz aging up when we play the other Let's Play. They will not age. I also just have aging off in general because because of this series is a much longer form kind of thing, like we're building up this whole farm, like it's not really something that we're going to be like, I had to turn it off partway through, I think the early access recording, because I mean, he's aging up so quick. I, I just turned it off. Uh, <laughs> otherwise, he would be dead before we did anything. So, <laughs> so the aging is off. We don't need to worry about that. Let's get up. Let's, um, I guess let's go scatter feed real quick. Oh, also my camera's a little in the way. Sorry. There you go. <laughs> let's go scatter feed. Uh, so we'll just get that done first. First thing first. And then I'm going to go grab uh, some leftover. Wait, what do I have as leftovers actually? I have, oh, that's right. The dango, which you guys are just like, it's like kind of like almost like a dessert kind of thing, which I mean, I kind of knew that when we looked it up and it's just like flour and sugar. So, you know, whatever. Anyway, so how do I... Uh, oh, yeah, so age elder. Okay, interesting. Does that, does that mean 
Uh, no, they still lay eggs. Okay, I, I don't know how chickens work, so I was just checking. So they still lay eggs. So still gonna get eggs, but I guess probably in the next few days some of these might uh, poof, poof away. I don't know how that happens, but we'll find out. Anyway, let's have your dango. Uh, you've left a stinky plate of them there. Let me get rid of that one. And I would like to take on some more errands today. And if we see Hazel again today, I think we'll have a good chat to her. Because uh, we are very shortly going to be needing help on the farm. Because I think once we get a little bit... Oh no, fuck. Hang on. Once we get a little further from the point we're at now, when there's even more plants uh, and, and animals, it's going to be very hard to take care of it ourselves. I am curious though if there is... Uh, if God, Well, gardeners, I assume, if we hired a gardener, would help with the crops. I don't know. Though the thing is, if we, are, if we buy sprinklers and get rabbits to help with the weeding, there won't actually be that much we have to do with the garden. We'll just need to fertilize and all that kind of stuff. But we'll, we'll see how we go. Get out of here, Fox. Now, okay, I really gotta go to the toilet. I really, we really need a downstairs bathroom. It's really annoying to have to go upstairs all the time. How much is this? I cannot afford it. That's annoying. <gasps> Wait a second. I know what we could get. The pee pee bush. This will actually be really nice on the farm. And for now, I'm just gonna put it right here. But like once we actually landscape the farm a bit more, oh, there's another Fox, really? Man, I gotta clean out these two things. Yeah, yeah, I I'm working on it, I'm working on it. I need to, well, I need to be in a good mood. I need to add the fox alarm because then that'll take care of this. <laughs> oh yeah. So <laughs> yeah, this, I didn't, I didn't even notice last time. But you guys pointed out how this fox's name is Brody, which is Chaz's father's name who he hates. Uh, but because of the timeline thing, he doesn't currently hate him. He should hate him. We should probably go fix that relationship. Well, fix, fix it to make him hate him because they did absolutely despise each other like full red. And uh, the fox has the same name. Oh no, Brody's an elder. Oh, I'm gonna give you a gift. I'm gonna give you canned good. I'm gonna give you... No, I'm not gonna give you those. You don't... Why would a fox want that? Sure, wait, get out of here. All right, let me um clean the shed and call Callie out. Now, the bin... Where is the bin out here? Do we have a bin? I don't see it. Oh, no, no, yes, right there, right there. <laughs> I knew it was around the chicken coop summer, but I was looking for the other bin that we used to have. Kowleen, I want to make sure you're in a good mood too. Uh, clean. Look, I'm not going to have, I guess, well, I was going to say I'm not going to have a shower, but I might as well just shower in the rain. I'm already out here. All right, so Kowleen is happy, clean, and full. Fantastic. No, 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 just shower in the rain. Now this is British countryside. Yeah, <laughs> this is what I'm talking about. I guess we should, um, we should do some terrain painting, you know, because that's I know that we, you know, we're obviously going to be building up this farm as time goes on, but we really should have like, whoa, uh, you know, there should be some wear and tear around here, especially where the animals are roaming and where Chaz is walking, which is going to be like sort of here. I'm going to add in some other colors, you know, kind of hard to see because the weather is absolutely brutal right now. Whoops, make it a little bit lighter than the chickens. Now, I know I think there was comments about saying how like chickens like grass. Of course they like grass. That's why my chicken coops are usually completely destroyed because the idea is they've kind of like destroyed all the grass that was in there. That's how I'm imagining it anyway. And there was comments about wanting more mud. So that's why I'm going a little bit heavier on the mud to rain paint this time around, which makes a lot of sense, especially if you're having this kind of rain, you know, makes sense. We will add in, you know, a little bit of grass. Maybe we're, we're trying to get some grass for the chooks. They get a little bit and I'll get like a little, there you go, get one of those. There's, you know, some grass over here. And apparently they do really like uh, bushes and some shade. We don't really have any trees or anything. I, I mean, I don't really have money, so... <laughs> Wait, what trees do we have around here? Do one of these, maybe. Yeah, let's get one of these here. That seems like a nice spot for it. Yeah, this is looking a little bit nicer now. Like, obviously, I haven't done this little area, but I think this is looking a lot better. <laughs> just, just standing in the rain. I mean, you could, you could like, try and clean yourself. You can just stand still, I suppose. All right, let's go clean this shed. Okay, that, that's enough. That, that's enough. Let's just... We're gonna have to shower again anyway after this. Let's call Lenny over. Oh my gosh, this rain is rough. I gotta go clean the coop as well. All right, there goes that. All right, let's uh, clean Lenny. Because, yeah, I know you probably don't want to be out in the thunderstorm, which is fair. <laughs> Def definitely fair. Uh, I mean, I don't really want to be out here either, but, you know, the farm is not going to run itself, okay? There you go. And uh, let me grab some of that wool off you real quick. I, this is not... Like, I mean, I'm just assuming, but I imagine if you're shearing, you know, a llama or a sheep, you probably don't want to do it in a thunderstorm, like pouring down with rain. Wouldn't it be all wet and just not like, I don't know. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I feel like that's not a good idea. All right, you go in. I, oh my gosh, I got to go clean this. Oh, and then, oh, they're making love in there too, but I got to clean this coop out. All right, let's clean that out. All the chickens are inside because they are like, we are not hanging out outside. Let me grab those eggs as well. I don't think I milked the cow, but I guess we're just going to leave it. 
I guess the good news is don't need to do any watering except maybe these mushrooms. Uh, but we do have to go weeding. So let's just quickly do that. I know not ideal weather, but you know, look, it's not, these aren't going to take care of themselves, okay? Now also looks like these are harvestable. So let's just harvest all the crops that we have. Oh, those needed to be weeded, but whatever, they're fine. So we've got all the crops. We probably just need to plant new ones. I'm wondering... Should we start keeping these or should we just keep selling them? I think maybe just sell them for now because I want to get a bigger operation. Like I would like to have an operation where we have the areas where we plant stuff that we're going to consume and then we have the, the area that we're going to sell. So I think that'd be a good way to organize it. But for now, I'm probably just going to go sell all this stuff. Uh, so let's go do that because we need money anyway. Okie dokie. Perfect day to go shopping. <laughs> oh wait, I'm super uncomfortable. I'm not gonna be able to haggle. I just go sell my items. You know, I'm glad you guys are open rain, hail or shine. Um, let's sell the eggs. Only $10 a pop. That's right. Oh, the midnight treat. Yeah, we gotta get that second uh, coop. Oh wait, no, I want the fertilizer. Keep that. Sell my small aubergines, my small lettuces, my small mushrooms. Man, none of these crops did that well. Small pumpkins. I guess we, because it was in between moving save games and all that, maybe it just didn't really get going, unfortunately. And some llama. Look, even though we didn't do that well today, 1200 bucks, really not too shabby. Now, whilst I'm here, I'm going to, you know what? No, let's go talk to the creature creeper. And we're going to get the errands from him because they're probably going to be the, the mashed one again that we're going to have to do because we sort of reset everything when we move save game. So let's go do the mushroom mash. I don't even remember what we need for that, like chocolate berries and stuff. And then like spicy mushroom or something. I don't know. But I think now the good news is we probably have all that stuff. So that's good. Hang on. Let me just, let me turn on my watermark again. Uh, welcome back to exclusive James Turner channel content. Uh, we have this watermark running at all times because this is brought to you by James Turner. Which, that's me. Um... That is me. You know what? I probably should buy an umbrella <laughs> around the rain all the time. All right, let me turn that watermark off. I just find it fun using that. Uh, man, this weather is rough. <laughs> Creature creeper. I can't even, where is your house in this weather? I cannot see it. Isn't it over here somewhere? Is this it? Oh, here we go. Oh good, he's still outside. <laughs> I'm not surprised. You say funny introduction. Oh, uh, did I? Oh, okay, hang on. <sighs> All right, hang on, hang on. Wait, where did he, oh, where did he go? Oh, he's here. Okay, hang on, let's try it again. You know what? Why? I need to buy a bike. We we need a we need a bike. Okay. Okay. When we get home, we're gonna get a bicycle. We need a because this world is like perfect for it, by the way. It's so big. So we need a bicycle and we need an umbrella. <laughs> this is just ridiculous. Hey, at least he's not scared though. Maybe because he grew up in a haunted house, he's not scared. Okay, for the third time, let's try and introduce ourselves. Thank you. I'll offer help with errands. There you go. I'm just gonna grab it. Uh, oh, I guess I can only get this one. I guess it's the intro one, probably. Give rabbit report. Oh, that's right. So what do we have to do again? Give rabbit report. Return to the creature keeper to give the rabbit report. Oh, oh, maybe because because I think it's saying that I've already done it. Like it clearly, like I, I have it, I guess. So maybe it's thinking because I have technically done this before. It still remembers that on, on Chaz. Though having said that, I don't seem to be able to do it. I might have to leave and then and see this guy again. So I'm, I might actually just run home. All right, so Chaz is definitely scared of the rain. So we're home. Let me uh, open this up. We're going to get a couple things. Bicycle. And I think we're obviously just going to buy the new bicycle that we get for purchasing early. Or in my case, this was actually thank you to EA Game Changers. So thank you, EA Game Changers, for the early access, which allowed me to get this bike. Uh, you know what they really need? They need bike stands, because it's kind of just random. What, this bike is going to sit out here? Can I put it against the wall? I guess so, but it's going to just end up in his inventory, so it doesn't really matter, does it? I like, I do like the yellow one. I'm going to go yellow. And then we also need the umbrella stand from Seasons, which we'll obviously put by the front door. There we go. Then we need another chicken. Uh-oh. Uh... <laughs> I just noticed he was here. Hey man, uh, what's going on? Okay, so then we're gonna get another chicken coop. Uh, this one is gonna be, maybe you could just go over here somewhere. Like, I, I think I need to really plan. I need to, we need to think about this and plan this out more. But for now, it's just gonna go over here. Well, actually, hang on. This is gonna be the evil chicken. So I do feel like we need more security. Okay, I, I, I'm sorry that it's raining so much right now and it makes it harder to see. But what I really want to do for the um, for the evil chicken is put it in like a compound. How much is this fence? Is this going to be a waste? Is this going to be a waste of my money? It's, de it's definitely going to be a waste of my money. Look how expensive this is. All right. Well, I, I wanted to put it in a fence and I want to do like a moat around it. And I want to do all this stuff. Uh, th there's big plans for the evil chicken, okay? 
But for now, we'll just use a stone fence because I mean, I can't really afford more than that. So this will just house one chicken and it will be evil and it will just be behind a little wooden gate. So it'll be nice and safe. And then we just do a little bit of dirt in here. There you go. And then we're going to do a little dirt pathway that sort of runs up and to here. Whoops. There we go. Just like that. That's that's probably fine. I don't I don't think we need to do too much on this. Just like a little bit of, you know, just a, just a pathway. I don't know. I think that just adds a lot of a lot more detail just having something going there. I guess I probably should do some stuff around here while I'm at it. We'll do some actual pathways and stuff. Well, I don't know if I want to go over the top with pathways, but we'll do some like actual proper landscaping when we have more money. It's just obviously we really don't have money at this point in time. So I think it's probably best just to do like dirt pathways that he's been using and walking on, you know? There you go, that looks a bit better. Just filled with mud everywhere because that's, you know, all he had. <laughs> he, you know, he doesn't have any pathways. I mean, look, he built a house. He's got a huge plot of land. So he's, he's very well off, but he just can't afford anything more than that. All right, so the Grim Reaper's here. That's fantastic. Let's um maybe... Should we go talk to him? Oh no, they're all coming out single file. You know what? Do we have... Hennessy! No! Dirty and unhappy. Oh man. Hennessy's time has come and now they'll be strolling around the rolling green hills in the sky. <laughs> oh, I assume we'll start seeing the rest of them pop away too. Now, do I need to do any cleaning? I think we're good. I think, well, I came back home because I wanted to, we'll invite, hang on, let me invite the creeper over, even though the weather's awful. I'm also going to say set as preferred bike and I might just drag that to his inventory so we just have it on us. It's probably the best way to do that. Take an umbrella. Uh, we are going to use the rubber duckies. Yeah. <laughs> cool. Uh, and oh, there goes my chicken. It's a shame you don't get a little tombstone. That's so sad. You don't get anything. They just vanish and you never see them again. All right. Now I need to give you what my, um, no, 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 not that friendly. My rabbit report. Apparently I can do, but quite frankly, I'm not seeing an actual option for it. I don't know. Okay. It has reset. Okay. No, no, it's reset. Okay. You can leave now. <laughs> I, I don't want to talk to you. Actually, you know what? I will talk to you because I need, let's have a hand for heart to heart because uh, my social is super low. I guess I could go talk to my chickens. That's probably a good idea too. I'm quite busy <laughs> and you have no good gossip. I have no good gossip. You're going to leave? What the heck, man? Fine. Leave. I don't want you anyway. All right. Let's talk to my chicken. Let me just put my umbrella away so I can talk to my chicken. Oh man. Come on, man. What are you doing here? I just, you were just here a second ago. Ah, oh, dear. Who, who's, who's up next, man? Hang on, let me go here. Can I, um... Hey, hey man. Are you... You... Oh, there we go. I was gonna say, you having fun up there? All right, who's coming out? Who's up? Oh, no, is it Ruli? Not Ruli. Anyone but Ruli! Yep, it's Ruli's time. Oh, hey, Michael. Why are you still here? I thought you were leaving. I thought you had somewhere better to be. No, you don't, you don't get to hang out here now. You already dissed me. You don't get to watch the cool Grim Reaper show in this beautiful weather. Goodbye, chicken. Goodbye, Ruli. You were a good rooster. And now, what? He's like, he's like having. What are you doing? He was being so nice. He was like, well, you're a good boy, and now you must die. The heck, man? Why, why are you still here? I keep sending you home, but you won't leave. Leave me alone. All right, I have a feeling we're going to see the Grim Reaper a few more times today. <laughs> Uh, well, I'm going to sleep. Now, what's the, what's the forecast looking like, by the way, this week? How do I... How do you see the forecast? I thought you could normally just hover over down here. I don't know. Look here. Sunny, cloudy, cl partly cloudy, partly cloudy, storm, sunny. Okay. All right. That's probably about right. I guess, well, once, I, once I've slept enough, I will uh, maybe plant some more crops and, and do all that stuff. Oh, yes. I need to upgrade this coop. Um, oh, I need two upgrade parts. That's annoying. Okay, so we've only got one. So we need to do more errands to get more of these. Uh, so yeah, we'll have to we'll have to help some more people out. Okay, it looks like we're gonna wake up at what like two a.m. or something. Which you know what? I'm not even. I'm I'm fine with that because we get woken up at five a.m. by the all the chickens anyway. So I'm gonna need another rooster. Uh, we could just well actually no, we're not gonna get any hatchable eggs. No, we need to buy a rooster. I was say we could just hatch an egg, but no. Well, we can't. Oh, wait, hang on. We might have hatchable eggs. These might be the last batch. Let's check. One hatchable. There you go. So we've got a... Oh, wait. Hang on. It's not... There it is. Okay, so we've got one hatchable eggs. I'm going to put that in there. Uh, and then we should get another chicken soon. Now, all these other eggs I should probably put in the fridge. Let's clean the coop. There you go. Now, the other question is, we've got um, three golden chickens in there and then a few hens. Let's... Should we just buy an... <laughs> There's a pathway all out here. Should we just... Let's buy... Hang on. First of all, let me go lock for everyone but Chaz. Let's go purchase a chicken. We're gonna get, I guess, just a brown hen, sure. Bike here, because it's gonna take you a while to get there otherwise, I reckon. And also biking is great, because it's gonna give us fun as well. Oh, isn't this cool? We have to we have to cycle across our farm because it's so big. <laughs> yeah, let's go. Woo! 
Okay, it's actually a little slower than I thought. I mean, I guess he's cycling over grass, so. Hey, what's up? <laughs> I have a special treat for you. You're gonna love this. You're gonna, you're gonna love this, okay? I'm gonna give you, no, no. <laughs> yeah, turns chicken into an evil chicken. Uh oh, okay, never mind. <laughs> okay. Let's try again. Give treat. Midnight treat. Now, how do we how do we make the midnight treat? Because I wouldn't mind making more of those. Because I'm wondering if evil chickens are profitable. You know, surely they, they sell for a bit. Wait, what? How come I don't know how to make a midnight treat? Shouldn't I have the information on that? Because I have it. I'm going to... Hmm. Maybe you can't make it. Maybe you're just eating an egg. Use for hatchable, hatchable obsidian eggs can hatch evil chicken. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, uh using obsidian egg to prepare eggs. Uh, hmm. Doesn't say anything about the maybe we can't make the treat. Maybe we can only buy it sometimes. Alrighty. Oh no no, here we go. Now now okay. <laughs> I spoke too soon. I probably should have just waited. So oh, it's cowberry jam and obsidian egg. Oh okay, cool. So that's fantastic. So I actually should go find some Snapdragon today so that we can start our process of getting our own cowberries instead of having to buy them and all that. Uh, should I maybe get out of here? I, I might um I might go here real quick and just get away from this chicken. Okay, here we go. So far so good. It is dark out. Oh. Oh, yeah. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh, but wait, wait, this is great content. James Turner. Okay, so now if anyone uses this footage, we know where it came from. Yeah. So what do, what do, what do evil chickens do besides potentially kill me? <laughs> wait, can I, will it let me just dress this chicken in this outfit that I have? Hey, evil chicken, there you go. Uh, and I'm, can I, what, what happens if I just, what if you like me? Is that, is that a problem? Oops, I don't know what I just clicked. Socialize, uh, pet. I'm not really sure what the temperament of an evil chicken is, but apparently it let me dress it. It's got f eyes of fire, so there's... Okay, can you Goku stop moving? There we go. Man. Okay, I mean, it seems to like me. So what, take clothes, send evil hand to coop, feed evil hand. I will feed you. I'll make sure you're fed. Ask for help. So wh what if I ask you for help? What does that do? Did you ever hear the story of Charles the Chicken? I thought not. It's a story the golden chickens would tell. It's Oh, it's not a story the golden chickens would tell. Sorry. Charles was a chicken so evil and powerful, he could even stop the ones he cared about from dying. Evil Han now has the fiery chicken magic of evil chickens and can use it to ward off foxes, household enemies, vampires, and even the Grim Reaper. Dang! I mean, you can't be that evil. You sound pretty good, to be honest. Tell a joke about being cooped up. <laughs> Man, can you imagine being stuck in a coop and cooped up and locked down in here in a quarantine section away from all the other chickens. Now, I'm a little concerned that I may forget about this chicken. So let's hope that I don't because it is so far away. <laughs> like, I don't know. Let's go clean the shed over here. Oh, yes, we're going to be cycling everywhere now. That's great. Oh, wait, never mind. <laughs> I was like, yeah, did not happen. All right, I probably need to feed you guys here. Let me scatter some feed near you guys. I need to get some more uh, bins actually around the place too. Scatter some more feed. Let's go clean this shed. I'm going to refill it. Refill the food in there as well. Now, I'm going to guess these two probably need to be clean. Oh, what a beautiful day out in the farm. This actually, you know what? This is great. Isn't this great? I love this so much. <laughs> okay, let's uh, clean out the shed. Feed level is half. It should be better now. I think we just got dust by the sounds of it, so we're going to have to do that too. All right, let's call over Kowleen. Oh, Lord. All right, let's... Uh, yeah, I thought this might be the case. Clean. Uh, that's all right. And then we'll do milking because I don't think we milked yesterday. It was a little rainy. All right. And then I also haven't planted anything. Oh, Kowleen. Come on. Let me just get the milk. There we go. Oh, hang on. Oh, no, no, no. The foxes are going all the way over to that one. Well, hang on. Surely. Well, hang on. Evil chickens scare away foxes. So maybe we're okay. Hang on. I think we're okay. All right. Well, I'll leave that for now. So Kowleen has been milked. I need to eat. We get leftovers again of the, the dango. Yeah, the fox is running over here. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Shit. Come on, hurry up. Let's go. What is this? Now what? Spilt milk. Oh, okay. Fair enough. Speaking of spilt milk, uh, let me put that in the fridge. And did I get any eggs? No. Okay, good. <laughs> now, what happened to that food? Oh, it's just here. It's, it blends in with the table. It's so hard to see it. All right, then I gotta go take care of Lenny because he might also be a mess. So how's this chicken over here? Let's just check. Clean and happy. How are you? How are you guys? Got a quick. Little ones over. All good. All right, Lenny, let me shear and clean you. Um, I don't own a vacuum, unfortunately, so we're just going to leave that and hope for the best. Um, now, I've got a little bit of money. Um, so why don't we buy some more oversized crop seeds? Five, and then we have six plots. So I should probably, I should probably fix the numbers of these. But anyway, let's plant oversized crop. Aubergine. 
plant oversized crop aubergine. Yeah, let's do some planting today. So these oversized crops apparently don't have seasons. Like we don't have to worry about them dying in the winter or spring or whatever. We should be good year round. It's just the smaller plants. These guys out here, all this kind of stuff has particular seasons we have to be aware of. All right, let's just make sure all my plants are watered. Okay, I guess we're watering that one. Okay, what about all the rest over here, dude? Come on, stop, what? How is that watering all? You did two. And then he gave up. Oh no. Thousand dollar bills. Oh man. Zaya, what are you doing here? Get out of here. Just because I merged back in the same game doesn't mean you can come over. <laughs> Alright, fertilize. Whoa, we got a lot of stuff. Okay, so let's go super vitality and then super vitality on this one as well. So these are the aubergines. We want some big aubergines. Hey, gardening level eight. Cool. It's also able to supercell plants in a large area. Fantastic. All right, so fertilize this with just regular vitality. Oh, I got another super vitality. Sure, why not? And vitality. Okay, so that should be all the gardening taken care of, which is fantastic. Let's, uh, do you have more wool? No, do you have more milk? You do. I'm just gonna ignore uh, Isaiah. I'm kind of, kind of busy. There's actually kind of a lot to do in the farm, you know? Oh, the fuck are you doing here? Hang on. Get away, get, go away, Brody. Get those eggs. Got three special eggs, which means we got some good golden eggs. Uh, you over here, I will bike over here because this is definitely further. Any eggs for me? Oh, you do have eggs. I guess we're probably gonna get, do, I assume we get, oh no, you get normal eggs? Oh, oh wait, no, one special egg, hang on. I think we do get obsidian egg from you. Maybe it says normal, but it's like normal for the evil hand. I don't know. Anyway, let's go sell this stuff and uh, get, a, get a few more things going on. Oh, actually, no, we'll go to the bramble wood and we'll find some rabbits to converse with and then do the rabbit report. We, we got to do all that stuff. Check the eco footprint. Wow, look how green that is up there. Cool. <laughs> oh, man, I totally just realized I had my watermark on for so long. My bad. Well, you know, we here on the James Turner channel feel it's very important to uh, make sure our content is not freebooted and posted on other websites without the appropriate credit. So we like to run our own watermarks for a long time. My bad. <laughs> I will try not to do that again. But the good news is at least guys are used to it from all the early action stuff. So it's not too out of place. All right, let's sell all my stuff for a profit. Oh, I need a, a Snapdragon as well. I might go looking for that. Oh, the golden eggs are beautiful, aren't they? The obsidian egg as well is pretty good. I always keep a little bit of llama wool in the hopes that we will someday do cross stitching. And we will. I just haven't got to that day yet. Now, actually, while I'm here, I will actually just check if you're selling a Snapdragon because I'm, I'm happy to buy one. But as far as I'm aware, we should be able to find them pretty easily in the world. Oh, there you go. Yeah, let's just buy a Snapdragon. Uh, so we need it. We, we're going to get the Snapdragon. We graft that with strawberry, was it? I don't know. I don't remember, but we'll grow that. That'll be fine. Great, thanks. That is so expensive though. Are you kidding? It's only $12, but that's fine. <laughs> we'll, we'll plant that and then we'll uh, be able to be on our way to cowberries. All right, so the bramble wood, go here and talk to some rabbits. All right, so we got a fox over here, got some ducks hanging out over there, got this dude in front of me here. Let's go to the little rabbit homes, which, yeah, there's one over here. Hello. Oh, yes, look at this bicycle now. This is gonna make our lives so much better around here. Oh, I'm actually super excited for that because it's gonna save a lot of time. Oh, here we go. Yes. Socialize. Show a dance move. Here's my sweet dance. Wait, so what do I actually have to do? Just converse. Dancing is in my bones. Do I like dancing? No, because I don't want Hazel to renovate my house with dancing stuff. <laughs> that, I don't think that counted as conversing. Let's just ask how it's going. There we go. Okay, so you didn't like that. All right. Um, cool. Uh, where's my creepy dude? No. I, why is it always so hard to find his house in this place? Where is it? Here it is. Is there a rabbit in this one? No. The rabbit nearby. Oh, it's gone. Rabbit just burrowed away. Oh, it just burrowed into its house? <laughs> Fair enough. What if I just like socialize again with you? I will give you a gift. Oh wait, no, I won't give you a flower. I need that. Never mind. I won't give you a gift. All right, I need another rabbit. Which I don't, are there any other rabbit homes here, or do we need to go somewhere else? Because this is a big area, but I feel like that's it. There's just, like just those two. Oh, hang on. There's a rabbit in here now. Oh, this is fantastic. Even though he needs to like pee really bad, he can still move quickly because he has a bike. Oh, this this is so much better. I wish we had this for the first nine parts. <laughs> it's so much better. All right, here we go. Lure the rabbit out. Oh, damn it. It was in there, now it's not. No, no, don't go home. Oh, I think he's going home. Uh, I, you could have just gone, you can just go to the bathroom here. Hang on, stop. Don't go home, don't go home, don't go home. Isn't there a public bathroom in here somewhere? I feel like there was, over the other side. Aha, um, um, what, what is going on? Ah, <laughs> okay. Uh, pff, all right, maybe, hmm. Oh, rabbit, stop, stop, stop glitching on your bike. I just need to talk to this rabbit. <laughs> Uh, what is happening? I don't care. It's fine. It's fine. Just talk to the rabbit. Talk to the rabbit. Talk to the rabbit. No, don't pay yourself. Talk to the rabbit. So talk to the rabbit. 
Talk to the rabbit, dude. Okay, I'm just gonna have to reset you. Yeah, yeah talk, talk to the damn rabbit. I don't care about you paying yourself. All right, cool. Now let's go home. I know my bike is there and it's not in my inventory, but I think it's fine. I think it just, doesn't it just pop back in my inventory? Or if it's like, if you save and reload, then it goes, I don't know. At some point it will be back, so who cares? All right, do you reckon, oops. He was supposed to have already peed himself, but do you reckon he can make it? Because we did actually have the interaction to pee himself, but then I reset him. Oh, we made it, sweet. All right, let's take a, take a speedy shower. Because I need to go plant that Snapdragon. Uh-oh, there goes Hanley. And okay, I'm gonna really need to restock these chickens. How long do this, this egg hatches? One day, eight, eight hours, okay. All right, bye Henley. I've got a dust bunny inside. I wonder if that cat's just conversing with a, with a bunny. I don't have time to vacuum my house, okay? Um, what was I doing? Oh yeah, planting the snapdragon. I'm just gonna plant, oh my God, even the greenhouse is dusty. I'm just gonna plant it in here so it's year round. Oh, there goes Hannah. Alrighty. Interestingly, I guess my first chicken, or second chicken, because the first chicken vanished. The second chicken, what, Henrietta, that we then turned into a golden chicken. I guess maybe when she transferred into a golden chicken, uh, her age must have reset because she's still an adult. So I don't know. <sighs> Evil chicken. I, I need to buy more chickens actually. Because we, we can hatch them all, but it's gonna take a lot longer to do that. All right, so the Snapdragon is now growing, which is fantastic. I might go ahead and we definitely need another rooster. Um, because we only have hens in here now. So let's go purchase chicken. We're gonna get what rooster did we have before? Do we have a black rooster or white rooster? Or brown hooster rooster. Brown hooster? I don't know. Let's get a white rooster. I feel like we didn't have that. I feel like we did at one point, but then we got rid of it. All right, so I'm gonna get a white rooster uh, and you can feel free to suggest some names in the comments. Also suggest names for our evil our evil hen too. That'd be great. So that's fine. Um, Do we need to collect eggs or clean? Let's go clean the coop and then we're gonna hit the hay. So we've planted the flower. We, are, are these all good? I think so. So a lot of the stuff's out of season. We should probably set up the greenhouse more. Okay, you don't really need to be cleaning up all the random dust piles everywhere. That, like that's fine. I don't know how that, oh, I should probably, oh yeah, oh no, oh no, my bills, my bills. Wait, how much were they? 1,033? Okay, that's all right. We'll be able to pay them tomorrow. I just do not want a Reaper Man coming now because we actually have stuff. <laughs> like the first time they came and we were in the alleyway, they stole what? A piece of chicken feed. I think now they're going to, well, I say stole. They repossess. And they're definitely going to repossess more than just chicken feed if they come again. Anyway, what I was going to do is say auto lights this light. Okie dokie. How are you guys going? You need some more chicken feed? Let me scatter some feed down here for you guys. Oh, okay. We just, there we go. Collect the eggs. All right. Just check those in the fridge. Wait, do we have a hatchable golden? I think we just did. I think I just put it in the fridge. Okay. We're definitely going to get another golden chicken. Uh, why not? Makes sense to me. Let's put all those eggs in there and then let's, uh, clean the coop, clean the shed. There we go. Milk cow lean. A little bit of a clean as well. Where's Lenny? No, 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 don't send Lenny in. That was the wrong option. Shear Lenny's wool. Clean Lenny. Uh, I need to refill and clean the shed as well afterwards. There you go. We should probably get some more uh, like animal treats and stuff and sort of vary these guys more because we've not really done a lot of that. But I just feel like we don't have time for all that kind of stuff, you know? Right, and clean the shed. And of course, we've got to go visit currently just Evil Hen. Socialize. We'll tell a joke about being cooped up again. I think that one landed pretty well the other day. Uh, and then we'll pet you as well. I want, I want you to like me. Like, you may be evil, but that doesn't mean we can't be the best of friends, you know? <laughs> what is this angle? It's so funny with Chaz just there. He's like, yeah, that's, that's my evil chicken. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> do you have enough feed? Oh, you do. Okay, we should be fine too. Uh-oh, my bills. Yeah, yeah, well, I'll get to that. Don't worry. Uh, it's fine. Um, so wait, you are happy, clean, and content. And is there an egg for me? There is an egg for me. And they, it doesn't need to be cleaned at the moment, which is great. Isaiah is going to GeekCon. That's great for you. I'm gonna go ahead and guess, yeah, there's more eggs to collect. And in a minute we may be at, yep, we can milk Callie again. Candle's calling me now, so we're gonna ignore that one. Uh, over here, we're gonna need to do some fertilizing. So let's do some vitality, some vitality, some vitality. And that's kind of all I have. I'll do, can, I do some minor growth, which for some reason, I still don't quite understand why that one never disappears, but I don't know. Um, okie dokie, let's open the fridge, grab out all my stuff that I'm gonna be selling and let's go to town. Whoa, I got 18 bottles of milk, dang. I do think next episode, because at this point I really am spending his entire day just doing the farm stuff. I think we really do need another sim, but I don't know if it should be Hazel yet. Like maybe we should, because I, I just don't think Hazel is quite ready. What are you wearing? Like, I, anyway, I don't think either of these things are quite ready to move away from their current let's plays. Like, well, I mean, Chaz would still be fine, but I, I, I don't know. Let me know in the comments down below. We either do move Hazel in and continue just one LP. So we 
just combine both LPs, or we move Hazel in, and we still do both LPs, but obviously they're going to be living in the same house, so it's kind of similar, but obviously in Hazel's LP, we'd be focusing on Dream Home Decorator, but it still means I'd have to do farming stuff in that LP, which is why I'm like, I don't know if it, I'm quite ready to have them move in together, you know? But I also do really want to experience that family cottage living life, you know? And have kids and have them help out on the farm and all that. Oh, she's not having it in the Oh, wait, no, she is. Okay, okay cool. <laughs> she's having it. Great. Yeah, I don't know. I'm not quite, I'm still not quite sure exactly when or how I would like the combination to go down. So I would love more feedback on that in the comments. Okie dokie. So that is a really good sale. 2,000 simoleons. Fantastic. What does she want? Oh, she wants spicy and lovely mushrooms. That's right. I think I have both of those now, so I can probably do that. Um, I will just see, do you have any, let me, let me do another errand from you. What's, what do you want? So now you want two bundles of beige wool. How do I get beige wool if I have a white llama? Do I just not? Or is that like a beige treat? Okay, before anything else, let's pay the bills. There we go. All right, let's head back to the farm and let's harvest spicy mushrooms and... No, the lovely mushrooms are out of season. Ah, I should have moved them inside. Whoops. That's okay. We just have to wait for them to regrow before I can give them to Kim. All right, so we'll move those in. So now they'll, they'll be sheltered and they should uh, start growing again. So what I'm going to do, I'm actually going to harvest Birds of Paradise because they're an excellent fertilizer. Man, he really needs to pee. Poor guy. Uh, <laughs> no, no, don't talk to you. Fertilize with the Birds of Paradise. Fertilize you with the Birds of Paradise as well. Because they're worth so much money, they're a really good fertilizer. Or, oh, no, don't talk to them. That was a mistake. <laughs> okay, so that's good. So they, they have some nice fertilizer. You can now go inside and go to the toilet. Take a shower. Okay. So yeah, I think I'm going to leave this part here. Really, the next step is we, def we definitely need another sim. Um, I would love it to be Hazel, but I'm just wondering how we how we actually do that. Like, because if we did it now, that means in her Let's Play, if that still continues at the same time, we'll still be on the farm. So I'd either just have to kind of ignore the animals in that Let's Play, or maybe what we do, the other thing we could do, and I just, this may work, it may not, we could have them both live here and live together and then we could buy her old house or the house she currently lives in and just remarket as like it's like a retail lot or something but obviously not use any retail or anything we just buy it then we can visit it and we own it and then we could live there when we do her let's play and then they could officially move in once we're ready for them to actually live together so we could do it that way but i'm really not sure i would love to see your thoughts and, and suggestions in the comments down below about how we do that and if we do that now i just i am keen i'm really keen to get into the family aspect of this as well and having kids and building up the farm and having more people to help out uh and I think we should try to see if a gardener helps us and see if that will make any difference. But I don't know. Let me know in the comments down below. I'm really excited to keep building this up. I really like now that we have some pathways around. That one's a bit dodgy, but I really like, you know, now that we have a bit of terrain paint, it's starting to come together a bit more. And as we get more money, we can finally build up the farm some more and, and make it look really, really cool. So I'm super excited to see how this continues. But thanks so much for watching. I'll see you next time and have an awesome day.